Hey guys, it's Patty here and welcome back to another video here on my channel. In today's video, we're going to do, be doing the follow-up to the part one I did on the how to build a realistic fire station. Uh, in, last video, in the last video, we did the front of the fire department. As you can see, we did the windows, just like the front frame and everything. We did like the doors and pretty much you can see what we did. So in today's video, I plan on getting done the sides and the back and then maybe, well not maybe, I know for a fact, there's going to be a th part three to this video. That's going to be, it's going to be the landscaping, like all that stuff and the parking lot and all that good stuff. Um, FYI, there is not going to be an interior on this. So I'm not good at interiors. So you, ca you guys can customize your interiors your liking i'm just not an interior guy so i just chose not to but uh yeah just feel free to customize this in any way shape or form you want so i mean you don't have to file off of it exactly but enough with the blabbering let's get started on this tutorial let me get uh out the correct blocks all right so we're going to be doing this side first and then we'll make our way over to the other side so this comes out 29 so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one twenty two twenty three twenty four twenty five twenty six twenty seven twenty eight twenty nine so that comes out 29 and then it goes three in the back so one two three let's put these right here and then seven so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then it goes another three. So one, two, three, one, two, three. So you got your window right here, kind of like over there. And then it goes another three. You jump another three right here and then you do four. So one, two, three, four, nope, four. And then you got that. So that's the layout of this part right here. So we're gonna do the windows over here. So it's gonna pretty much just be a bunch of threes and then a five. So one, two, three, and then space three. One, two, three, space three. One, two, three, four, five. And then space three. One, two, three, space three. One, two, and then three. So there's our window layout. So now what we are going to want to do is just fill all this up. So it's going to go pretty much up to this height. So let's just bring this over like this so we can tell where our window height is going to be. So just fill this up, fill up all the middle bricks. And then for this one right here, so on the right in the second window closest to the middle, you're going to break this because this is a door. So break that and then just continue to fill up all your brick. Same here. And then we're just gonna do that window design we have over here and we're just gonna do it over here. So grab these, grab that, and we already have that. So for here, just line this with a block of smooth sandstone, like so. So you should have something looking a little bit like this. Now you're going to want to take your dark oak fences and you are going to want to come up three. So one, two, three. Now take your, actually you don't need a block. So go that, do that, do that. And then same thing here. Just bring it up four instead of three. And then that, that, that. Same here, three, that, that, that. And lastly, three, that, that, and that. So now you should have this. So you should have the window layout. So that's what you should have so far. Now, pretty much what we're gonna do is, let's just finish this off and then we can fill in all the up stuff. So like we've been doing, just keep on filling up these brick uh, little things that we got going on here. Just fill them up. Like so. And then same thing here, go up three. And then you want to take any block, doesn't matter, and just go like this. And then just place your trap doors on top, because 
it's just way easier than crouching and doing all that stupid stuff. Now you're gonna wanna take your block and just line it like that. And then for over here, instead of doing a block, you're going to want to first get your dark oak wood. And then after you get your dark oak wood, you're going to want to grab smooth sandstone slabs. Just line the top of that like that. And then we're going to do this and then stick it out. And then so one, two, three, four. So you're, that should go up four and then you should have the slab sticking out like that. So you should have the two slabs. Now what we're gonna do is just, we're gonna level it all out. So we're going to just fill this all up like I'm doing. Just fill it up like this. And then when we're doing this right up here, we're not going to continue it all the whole way. So we're just gonna bring it to where we think so should be right here and the way you can test this out is just bring this over like this because we have to bring it over anyway so just bring that over like that and then it should line up so this is you should have that that front like piece come all the way back and meet right here then your sandstone should stop right next to it now you're just going to take your smooth sandstone slab and just line the entire thing like we did in the front so now you got this little side piece that's pretty much done now for the window we are going to do this so okay so we're gonna go three and then just bring it all the way here let's do this so it's easier so just go over to the front and then take this piece right here where your thing is just take that now bring it all bring it all the way over like so and then just fill up this three right here now you're gonna want to go four so one two three four and then one two three and then four again so one two three four and then five instead of three so three four five have that and then three so then one two three and then just fill us all up we don't care about this just fill it all up and then you have this so now we're just gonna do the windows so just line the windows with the with the sandstone smooth slabs or whatever they're called and um, you should have that now for these windows we're gonna do the same window design that we've been doing, but it's a little, a little more complicated because it's a bigger window. So for this, just take out a block and just do that. It's way more easier. I keep on forgetting how these work. So right here, okay. So it should be right there. So like so, and then should, nope. Wow, I should break that one if you have to. And then go like that. And then you can do this bottom one. These are a little complicated. I don't, I don't even understand this at all, but it is what it is. So just do this for these also. So here, you got four. Then you're gonna wanna go up to here, put that in, delete that here. Same thing for this one. Just fill that up, break it. Same thing, do that, do that, 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 here, same thing, do that. So now you should have something looking like that, or here, let's go on the other side. So now you should have something looking like that. You got your windows all put in and stuff, so that's what the windows on the side should look like. Now we're going to do the roof. The roof is probably uh, one of the, I don't know, it's kind of hard, not really. So you're gonna place your slab, and then you're gonna go one, two. So it should be a slab and then a full block. And then just take your slab and just bring it all the way up. So we're just gonna bring it all the way up and just estimate for now, and then we'll connect the tips. That's not good. We'll connect the points um, to uh, our like, one more, yeah, you know what I'm saying. 
so for here this is a little bit more complicated so it should go like that let's see should go this is very weird hold on how does this work this is weird um hold on, let me see what's going on over here this one always confuses me because of how the roof connects okay so it's okay i see what we're doing so slap the full block all right okay that's pretty easy so for here we're going to do so slab and then full block so it looks it should look like that so slab full block slab goes like right here then just bring it on up so just keep doing that and we're just gonna bring it up to a point like I've been saying so just bring it up to a point so now you should have your little roof lining and we're just gonna take another slab and just line it up again. So just take a slab and just hit the bottoms of it like I'm doing. So, okay. So now your roof should be looking like this. So now all you want to do is you're just gonna take your brick and then you're just gonna fill it up. And then when we get to the top, we're gonna do like this like i don't even know if you would even consider it a design it's just like there i guess in real life it's a design but minecraft yeah you can't really do much about that so we're gonna go one and then we're gonna go two three and then just go like that so it should look like this i think that's correct right Let's go double check. I'm pretty sure it's correct. So, okay, yes, we're correct. Yeah, we're correct. Okay, so now your roof should be looking like that. And what? Maybe we aren't correct. Hold on. What we got going on here? Yeah, we are correct. Okay. Are we? Yeah, okay. Now, what you're gonna wanna do is, you're gonna take your slab. Actually, no, let's not do that, scratch that. We're gonna go here and we're gonna come out 16. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Now, all you're gonna wanna do is just bring it around. And we're just gonna connect it to here. So go over here. We're just gonna bring this back and connect it to that. So now you should have this little like layout looking thing. And now we're going to do this side of the building. So we're going to bring this back. Like, so, uh, yep, okay. Bring this back like this. And then just come down here and just bring it up like that. And then pretty much from here, it's pretty much all flat on the bottom. So here we're just gonna do that. And then down here, it's just all flat. So you don't have to worry about that. So just fill this all up. I still think I did the roof wrong. You might have to go back and check. do that in a second I feel like it's not how it's supposed to be so you should have this all filled up and now for this let's just bring it up and then just meet it right here also so we're just gonna meet it so then you have a box layout looking thing and then for this it should be let's see I think it's five it should be yeah so five Five, two, five. Okay. I'm, I'm thinking that's what it is. So one, two, three, four, five, and then two, and then one, two, three, four, five, and then it should be five in the middle. So five, then one, two, three, four, five, two, 
one, two, three, huh? Hold on. Oh, I messed this up. So five, five, okay. So five, two, five, middle five. So five, two, five, 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 two, five. So now we're just gonna continue to fill all this up right here. Like this. Just fill it all on up. And then we're just gonna pretty much continue what we've been doing with the windows. Just gonna take the windows. We're just going to do that same design. So now you got it all filled up, filled up. Now we're gonna take our slabs, our smooth sandstone slabs. Just line it for here. You're gonna wanna take out dark oak planks. Just make a middle line like that. Then just put your slabs next to it. So now, come on. So now you should have your window looking like this. So from here, you're going to just do the window design. So, nope. So here, just boom, boom. Then, nope, boom, 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 boom. Same thing, boom, 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 boom. And then here. All right, so now your windows are looking like this. So just so we know what we're doing, we're just gonna bring this smooth sandstone slab around and it should connect to the other side if we've done all of this correct. So just bring it and just wrap it around. Bring it around town. So just bring this all the way around. So it does connect, that's good. So now we're, let's just put this little vent in. So come down like one, two, three, and then on the fourth block, you're gonna break it, break two, and then get your coral or dried kelp block or whatever, and just do that. So it's like a little vent that's there. I don't know what it does in real life, but let's go double check and see what we did wrong here. I just don't understand because it's, yeah, I don't, I don't see what we did wrong. How does this work? Yeah, what's what do we do wrong? Hold on. Let's go. I'm pretty sure I did this all correct. That's what I don't understand. Um The top should be a slab then a full block. So it's the opposite. What? Hmm, that's weird. Hold on, I'm gonna cut the video and I'll get back to you guys. Okay, so I found what the problem is. I just fixed the roof. So the problem was, so I built the roof like slab down here instead of up there. So what you're gonna wanna do is just pretty much do what we just did. So you're gonna take the slab, move it up to here. So then you have, if you were to bring this over, it would be looking like that. And then you're gonna do that. And then you're gonna place, so you're gonna go slab and then full block. And then just do this going up. So just like do like the normal, like, you know, that, that, and that, that, and that, you know what I'm talking about. And then go up and then go up to where it is at the fourth or like the yeah the fourth block so it looks like that and then just fix it so then it looks normal and then you can destroy this over here and then just uh fill all this excess stuff in like this and then do it like what we did earlier so take your take your slab and just line the just take another slab and just go under and line the bottom so it's like thicker than normal so then now it should be looking like that so now it's fixed that was my fault i guess i just wasn't paying attention so now we're just gonna bring this over just bring this on over and we're going to do the roof line over here so one block and then do this so bring it up like this so if you weren't paying attention earlier now's the time or if you didn't understand what i was doing earlier then now's the time to see so just do what we're doing here. 
same thing over here just gonna go uh, full block then just do this just bring it all on up just keep doing this and then when you come up to this point you're just gonna line the bottom so just line the bottom with another slab so then it should be thicker lining it okay so now we're just gonna take our brick and we're just gonna line it on up just or not line all up just fill it on up and then same thing with the roof design just fill it up and then we're gonna do that sandstone thingy my bobber so do this do that do that nope destroy that and then do that so now you got that, and now we're just gonna bring this down one, two, three, and then make it five. So three, four, five, and then just fill that up with your smooth sandstone. So now you got the roof design over here too, and that's what this side should be looking like. And for here, we're just going to bring, we're just gonna fill this on up. So bring your brick all the way up to about here. And then for here, you're gonna take a smooth sandstone. It should do. It should make a full block. And then you're just gonna bring it on out. And then just take a brick right here, and then bring it on up. And then just connect these. And then you can just make a cube. So just make your cube. So bring it on over. Connect it over here, how it was over there. So make a little connection. And then just bring it over here. So now you got your little outline cubey thingy. And now what we're gonna do is we're literally just gonna fill all this up. Same with the other side. So just fill it up like this. So it's just a blank wall. How we're doing it. So just keep filling it. So then you got that. And then we're gonna do the exact same thing on the other side. So we're gonna come over here. We're gonna fill this up also. And then after this, we're going to do the garage door, the back garage doors for the fire department. So now we have something looking like this. So now we're gonna go and try and meet it with the other garage doors. So we're gonna go two, three, four, five, and then one, two, three, four. So in total, this should be nine. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Make three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then bring this up. Same thing with this. Bring this up. And then basically that's where our garage doors are going to go. So just fill up all this extra brick that we got going on over here. And to be honest, you don't have to put these, like if you're putting this into like a residential area or something where you don't have a back entrance or you can't put a back entrance, you can just put windows here if you really want. And then from here, we're going to, wait, let me fill this up real quick. So when we're doing the garage door, it should have a seven gap. So when we get to that, I will show you what I'm talking about. Let me just fill this up. So this is what I was talking about. So it should be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then on the seventh block, put a slab right there. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and then like a half, but technically seven. So just bring the slab over, same over here. Just gonna bring the slab over and then just fill this up here, which is more brick. You got a lot of brick in this, I'll tell you what. And then should have that and now we're just gonna do the garage door so you're gonna want to get spruce wood stairs spruce planks and then spruce uh, spruce wood slab so for this we're just gonna fill it up do what we did with the front bay and we're just gonna fill it up like this just make a square like so just keep filling it 
which have that. And then here, we're just gonna do exactly what we did. So two from the bottom, and then same thing. So stair, 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 then slab, stair, stair, stair. Nope, screw there. So then you have that. Then we're just gonna do that two times instead of three, because the door's smaller. So stair, 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 stair. Nope, slab, stair, stair, stair. Same thing over here. Just gonna fill this up and then do the stairs again. Just fill it all on up. Like this. And then, nope, wrong thing. Delete this and then do the exact same thing. So stare, 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 stare. stare. And then again, one more time. Just do that and then slab in the middle and stare, 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 stare. So now you should have your doors in the back looking like that. I don't know what's up with that lighting glitch, but it's kind of annoying. All right, so now onto this part, we're going to do the back windows. So literally, these are probably the easiest thing about the entire fire department. What we're gonna do is just line up with the front windows. So you got come one, two, and then two, and then this should be five. So one, two, three, four, five, one, two, space three, or well, space two, three, space two, and then five again, and then space two, and then three, and then space two, and then five once again, and then space two, three, space two, five, and then two. So you should have something looking like that. So now you're just gonna fill it up all the way up here. Bring our brick across so we know where the window ends. And then just continue this. So for this part, I'm gonna speed it up a little bit because you guys should know like what to do. So you're just gonna take your, your dark oak and your smooth slab and you're just gonna do, you know, the basic window design. So I'll catch you back when I'm finished this and when you guys are finished also. So now we're done the windows. So what we're just gonna do, we're gonna do the roof. I'm probably gonna fast forward this too because it's like way too boring to watch. So we're just gonna take stone brick slabs and we're just gonna line the roof. So when you're lining the roof, you should have this like like this like thingy mabobber. See how the slabs are sticking above it? That's what it should be like. So pretty much just fill all that up to the top like this. And then like if you accidentally play or yeah accidentally place brick somewhere and it's like this or whatever and you can't like you can't place your slab you can probably break it and you'll be fine but if you're not then you've done something wrong but over here i'm just gonna show you how i did this because this is the complicated part so here we're just gonna pretend that there's technically slabs here then you're gonna take your stair and then you're just gonna just go like this, pretend like when you have this all filled up, just go like this, go like that, same thing here, just go like that, have that right there. So then you have this going on. And then just take this over. Like so, like here, see I can break the brick without anything showing. That's what you want. Then you should have like this going on right here. 
So that's what it should look like. You got your slab, you got your like stair, and then just bring your stairs over like that, connect it, connect it, and all that. And then here you can just bring your slab across. And then now you should be good. So that's what to do with this part right here. So that's pretty much gonna conclude this. So for here, you're just gonna fill this up with stone. If you have, like, if you're on my version, you can just do slash fill. If you wanna know how to do that, you can always look on my channel. Um, so just fill all this up with stone. Same with over here, just fill, just fill this square up with stone. And yeah, like I said, this is going to do this. This is going to conclude our part two of this. Um, I'm going to make a part three that will be out tomorrow. It is going to be the landscape and it is also going to be the parking lot and all that stuff. So if you guys do enjoy this tutorial or if you guys did enjoy this tutorial, please leave a like and subscribe. You can obviously finish here if you want and build your own exterior or you can continue to watch and see what mine looks like if you want it but if not then i hope you guys did enjoy this tutorial um i plan on having more like this and yeah so if you guys did enjoy this video please leave a like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video